Hi everybody, welcome back to Mando Lessons. Today we're going to work on the great Irish polka, The Britches Full of Stitches. It's a great tune in the key of A major. I'll play it through once so you can get a sense of what it sounds like, and then I'll break it down into sections so that you can learn it by ear. I do recommend learning tunes by ear, as it's really good practice um, and can sort of help you tear yourself, tear yourself away from the page. Um, if you do need help though, there are tabs in standard notation over at mandolessons.com as a last resort, um, as well as chords to play along with. There's also play along tracks, so you can play the melody while I play the chords and the guitar, and I can play the chords while you play the melody. Um, there's also a couple ways to donate, which is always appreciated, but not necessary. Um, helps me make more lessons like this anyway. Um, but for now, let's get back to the tune. Uh, the bridge is full of stitches. I'll play it once and then break it down. Kia A. One. short and sweet. All right, so first phrase sounds like this. Let's do that again. And again. One more time. Next phrase. And again. And again, and again, let's put those two together and it sounds like this. Do that again, next phrase, same as the first. Next phrase, again, 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 <clears throat> put that with the phrase before it and it sounds like this. Again. Put those two phrases, sorry, those two little sections together, and that's the first half of the A part, and it sounds like this. Two, three, four. Again. Next phrase, same as all the others. Then the next phrase is slightly different. So, goes up to the open E. And again, put those phrases together. And then the last couple phrases. Let's put that all, that, that's nice, just sort of lump those last two measures together. Again. So putting that second half of the A together sounds like this. Let's 
So let's put the whole A part together, <clears throat> excuse me, and play it. Sounds like this. One, two, three, four. Next phrase it sounds like this. So we're into the B part. Sorry, I neglected to say that. Do that again. Starting on the E string. Again, next phrase, again, again, one more. Put those first two phrases together in the B part, sounds like this. Again. Next phrase. Exactly like the beginning of the B. And the last phrase is the same as the ending to the A. So I think we've got the ingredients for the entire B section here. Um, sounds like this. One, two, three, Now you've got all the parts, time to play it through A-A-B-B. Just as a reminder, the A part sounds like this. Here we go. One, two, three, four.
that's the whole tune. Again, if you have any trouble spots in there and feel like you need the tabs or standard notation, mandolessons.com is the place to go. Um, as well as play along tracks, you can practice. Or even better, get together with a friend and teach them the chords and get, get playing music and having fun. Play it through one more time in more polka style, um, a little more up tempo. Um, polkas have this great kind of backbeat. So I'll add a little bit of that in, it's probably as well as some double stops. Um, if you're interested in adding double stops and drone notes and hitting other strings while you're playing the melody, that sort of thing, if you want to add that into your playing, um, there's a whole series over at mandolessons.com that teaches you how to do it. And I highly recommend it if you're into that sort of sound. Um, but here it is, uh, the bridge is full of stitches. Thanks for watching. Hope to see you again soon. Bye-bye.